Tour de France is three weeks. It's three, three and a half, four thousand kilometres. It's, it's, it's massive. The old joke is it's the only sporting event that uh, you have to get your hair cut in the middle of. That's how long it is. It's uh, up massive mountains. It's across vast expanses of the country. And uh, for many, and who can argue with it, it's the greatest uh, feat of endurance in international sport. There was a special bond between Marco and his grandfather. And um, his grandfather gave him his first bike, the, the Red Vicini. And um, it was a relationship that all the way through his life he would try to uh, replace. When Marco finally won the under-23 Giro d'Italia, um, a race, he finished third in uh, 1990, second in 1991, finally won it in 1992 and immediately after the race his grandfather died and it was a relationship that he desperately needed and that he recreated with other grandfather figures through his life but there's something strange about that um, constellation of the long desired victory and the death of someone dear to him. It had happened uh, when he first started cycling, when he was 14 years old. Um, a neighbour uh, who'd been the president of the Fausto Coffee Club had died uh, when he was celebrating uh, one of his very first victories. And this association of um, victory and the death of someone loved is something that echoes through Pantani's existence, uh, through to the great uh, the classic year of 1998.